Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the Wi-Fi antenna or the GPS antenna on the iPhone 6. Now you need to remove the two pentalobe screw at the bottom. Once it is removed, you can uh, pry out the screen. So using a suction cup, we will uh, pull up the glass. So just be careful that you do it gently and not to break the glass. Okay, now uh, gently lift up the glass and make sure it does not uh, go past the 90 degrees. We remove these five wheels here and then remove the metal plate and uh, disconnect the four flex cable. As you can see here, there are four flex cable to remove. Next, you want to remove the battery cover. So this metal plate has two screws to remove. Now remove that two screw and remove the metal plate. And we will disconnect the battery flex cable and the charging port flex cable and right next to it is also an antenna cable that we need to remove. So now we remove the charging cable, flex cable. And there is the antenna. We also need to take it out. Just gently and be careful. Next, remove the SIM tray. Now at the top here, there are quite a lot of screws, so looking at the pictures, we move the screws in the red arrow and the blue arrow. You also need to disconnect the camera, this is the rear camera. So here are the screws that you need to remove. This is the metal plate covering, so remove that. We'll uh, expose uh, some connector underneath and another screws underneath. So we move all the screws. Make sure you put them in the right position because they all have uh, different size. So disconnect to uh, these two uh, connect connectors. These are the screws that you need to remove. Okay, so now we remove this uh, Wi-Fi antenna uh, cover, and removing that cover, we also will expose another screws underneath. You will need to remove only one of the screws. So I'm going over here and remove the screw next, right next to the camera. Now this remove this uh, particular screw here that's uh, screwing down the, the motherboard. Lift the other screws on because we don't really need to remove it. So the middle screw also need to be removed. So we move that one. Now the board is loose and it is not attached to the housing frame anymore. We can now easily remove the board. Just uh, gently uh, wick out the board so that we don't uh, accidentally damage it. So there you can see there is nothing attached, so we can remove the board. Once the logic board is removed, we are now ready to replace the Wi-Fi antenna or the GPS antenna. So there is the replacement part, as you can see. If you turn the board uh, over, you can see the Wi-Fi antenna is just right there. It has uh, a four connector that you need to uh, pry out. Uh, there are some really tiny component underneath so when prying out this four connector you need to be very very careful that you don't knock out any of the tiny components underneath or right next to it so there that's the two connector at the top 
and two at the bottom there that you also need to pry out so that's the four connector now put the old antenna away and we will replace it with a new antenna so there is the new antenna we will uh, push it down and make sure it is connected to the board so then as you can see it is now connected to the board make sure it is connected otherwise you will not get a good signal and hence uh, why you need to replace it in the first place once it is uh, connected you can now put the board back onto the housing so this is pretty much in the reverse order of how you uh, remove it so make sure the connector sits on the top of the board sometimes they can get stuck underneath so go around and make sure everything is on top and nothing it gets stuck underneath the board for example this one here the camera flex cable needs to sit on top so pry them out and make sure they sit on top once the board sits properly in place you can uh, put back the screws I uh, like to put the one back in the middle first to make sure the board is uh, secure now at the top you need to uh, put the screw back in as you can see there in the picture so pretty much in the same reverse order next you can uh, connect the flex cable the battery flex cable and the charging port and the antenna after that uh, put the metal plate back on and secure it with the two screws at the top there is the screen connector so connect all the, the screen connectors and the camera connector and now you can uh, put the screen back on close it up gently secure the screen into the frame so firmly uh, push it down at the bottom there make sure you put the two pentelope screw back on and now you can switch on the phone and test out your Wi-Fi signal so you can see you, that should uh, fix your Wi-Fi signal so if you previously have a weak signal now you can see uh, the Wi-Fi signal is really strong you can uh, open up a YouTube videos or something and give it a test and see how you go thank you for watching this video if you like it please uh, leave a comment and subscribe to my channel thank you